Hi everyone, GD here. Glad you could join me today. Well, today is May 21st, 2024. Did you guys see what the price of silver has been doing? Last I looked this morning, it was 32.27. So it is trying desperately to make another big move. I am not going to sit here and predict where I think this is going to go, but it's looking very seriously like it wants to break out and go to 50. What do you guys think? I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Please leave a comment down below. Well, I think it's about time. I've mentioned this a few times, but it is time for me to start cleaning house and getting things ready for my family um, so that there is not a whole bunch of stuff that they have to deal with. Now, I'm going to start small here today, but there's going to be some good buys here. Um, again, I, I think I looked, it was 32.27 for silver. So I've got a, a thing here where I'm going to sell some for below spot. I've got some here that's going to be a little bit above spot. So pay attention here, folks. Today's your opportunity. Uh, take a look at what we've got here. I have got a tube. There's uh, I sold three of them out of here. So there is 17 of these left. Uh, these uh, Morgan 999 silver rounds here. Um and they're one troy ounce each. So there's 17 ounces here. So these, and these are all, they've never been touched. Uh, you know, I pulled three out of the top and sold them off, actually traded them off uh, for some um, scrap this past year. And uh, there's 17 left in this tube here. Uh, these I'll do for $32 an ounce, folks. So that is below spot for somebody out there that is... Um, looking to add some more silver, I realize it's getting more and more difficult to find good deals. So this is a good deal. $32 an ounce. I have 50 ounces of prospector bars here. I've got one of this style here and four of this style here. These are all 10 ounce bars. And these here I will do for $33 an ounce today. So there's your opportunity there. And then I have a tube of maple leaves here. This is actually the first time. I, I, when I bought these, I put them away. I never even looked at them, folks. So um, we're taking a look at these, I think, for the first time out of the tube. Uh, this looks like it is a, uh, let's see, the date is on the other side on these. I think these are 2011s, if I remember correctly. Yep, 2011 maple leaves. I don't see any... Uh, Anything going on here on this? They look like they're pretty clean coins. Let's take a couple of them out just to make sure. Just to make sure. Let's see. Looks pretty clean. Pretty nice coins. I know some people get worried about milk spots, but uh, these look like they are pretty cool looking coins. Okay, so what I'll do on the maple leaves and, you know, the tube... Well, this one here looks like it's got a little bit of milk spot going on around here. So I'm not going to go through the whole tube. There may be some in there that do have some milk spots. These have got a few milk spots around here. But for the most part, what I grabbed there, that's the only one that is that way. Um, but in any case, these here I will do for $34 an ounce today. So we got 32, 33, and 34. On the tubed ones, I'd prefer to sell them complete, um, but I'll talk to you anyway if uh, you've got some other idea going on there. Um, that's these items here. Then I have a whole bunch. I'm only bringing out a few of them right now. Um, a whole bunch of um, proof and mint sets that I'm going to want to start moving out. Uh, these are, if I believe all of these were from, let me take the gloves off so my hands work a little bit better. I don't think the complete series is here. Um, these are going to be the state quarters. Uh, this one here is a mint set. You know, a lot of people buy these here for um, breaking out to um, send them off. And these look like they're pretty nice looking coins. Um, this one here has got the uh, five quarters and uh, the rest of the set. Let's see, these are proof coins. Um, 
So we've got that. I've, I've got, um, looks like I've got 1999 out here. I'll have to look and see what other ones I have. So if you folks are interested in this kind of thing, ask me and I will tell you which ones I have. Uh, it looks like I got 1999, 2000, 2001, 2002, 2003. Uh, in silver as well as clad, 2004 in silver as well as clad, 2005 in uh, clad and silver, and 2006 in clad and silver out here right now. I know that there are others in the box. I don't know what dates are in there. Let's just pull out one of the silver sets. These are all proofs. Uh, beautiful coins. You know, I don't even know if I ever looked at these things for errors. I think uh, when they were purchased, they were just put away. I was buying these for my um, for my son and stepfather um, and just putting away a set myself at the time. So I'm sure I am going to be selling these for below what I paid for them. Um, this one here looks like it's got a little bit of toning going on right there on that one horse. I don't know if that's showing up or not. Um, but I never did check any of these for errors, so who knows? There may be something special in there. You folks will have to decide on that. But, um, I have got these out here, and again, I don't know what other dates I have. I'll have to take a look, but I want to start off with something small. So on these, uh, we'll be um, open to offers on these. So feel free to get in touch with me. And if there's others you want me to see if I have, I'll be glad to look in the boxes that I have them in. Um, but feel free to get in touch with me at gdsavingthepast at gmail.com. Uh, make me an offer on them and we'll see if we can come to a meeting of the minds on it. I am going to be very fair on them. So um, don't fear on that, folks. Uh, you can see on these things here, I'm going to be very fair, selling these at $32 an ounce, $33 an ounce, and $34 an ounce. I know you would probably pay a lot more than $33 an ounce for these right now if you, are, if you um, got them um, on eBay or, or directly from the company um, that mints these, uh, Prospector Gold and Silver. Any case, uh, these are set in stone. That's the price I want from today. Tomorrow it may be different, so feel free to reach out to me because it'll be first come, first serve. I'm only shipping to the United States, and um, I'm only taking cash, check, or PayPal on these. Yes, I'm going to wind up taking it. Uh, I'm wind up losing money on these um, because PayPal does charge for uh, me accepting cash from them. So, but um, this is what I'm willing to do today. Tomorrow I may have a different idea, but uh, this is what I'm willing to do today. So don't waste your time, folks. Silver could be $50 an ounce next week. I don't know. You tell me. But in the meantime, if you're interested in a good buy, here's a few good buys here. Again, these back here, get in touch with me and make an offer. These here, it'll be first come, first serve, whoever gets in touch with me and pays for them. I'd prefer to sell the two tubes complete, 25 ounces here and 17 ounces here, but I will break this one up over here if I have to. I just assume keep the maple leaves uh, as a full tube, but I'm flexible. So get in touch with me. Um, again, I'll be very reasonable on what I'm willing to do with you folks. Okay, I hope you're all doing well out there, and I hope this little um, video here gives you at least a little bit of an opportunity to put away a little bit more silver before we wind up with some kind of out-of-control market out there. Um, I need to start cleaning up things. I know I should be waiting to see if this does go to $50 an ounce, but I need to get things started. I have an awful lot of stuff that I need to start um condensing here. So um, get in touch with me. Oh, by the way, I will consider doing a trade for gold bars or coins or even gold scrap. I will consider that as a possibility. So um, keep that in mind. Um, but until next time, I think this is a good buy for somebody out there that is willing to get in on it. 
Okay, hope you're all doing well. I hope you're all finding something interesting to put away. Until next time, this is GD saying, have a great day.